spices can be found in just about everybody's kitchen, but there's a new study revealing that some spices may contain something extra concerning levels of heavy metals. CBS 2's Naomi Rockham reports. Most of us shake spices on our food and add them to our recipes without much thought. But Consumer Reports found there could be problems with some of them. Of all the spices that we investigated, one third of them had concerning levels of heavy metals, lead, cadmium, or arsenic. Chief Scientific Officer James Dickerson says Consumer Reports tested 126 herbs and spices from 38 different companies. In every brand of oregano and thyme, concerning levels of heavy metals were detected. The metals were also found in almost all brands of ginger and basil tested, and in around half of the paprika and turmeric brands. Studies have shown that frequent exposure to lead, cadmium, and arsenic can be damaging over time. For children, during their early stages of development, these heavy metals can adversely impact their neurological development as well as the respiratory development. Spices are often grown overseas, where contaminated water can lead to heavy metals in the soil. The American Spice Trade Association says an analysis showed spices make up less than 0.1 percent of dietary lead exposure in children ages 1 to 6, and the risk is low in adults. What should people do with this information? Don't panic. Dickerson says the good news is every brand tested of curry and garlic powder, black pepper, coriander, sesame seed, and saffron did not have concerning levels of metals. Think about what herbs and spices that you and your family use and diversify the amount that you use. So don't overload on a particular spice. He says choosing products with low levels can make sure you and your family stay safe. Naomi Ruckham, CBS News, Yonkers, New York. And in the Consumer Reports tests, organic products did not perform any better than non-organic spices.